Hello everyone and welcome to another video with Coach B from MasterChess.com. This video is the intro to the playlist that involves Rook and Pawn versus Rook endgames. This playlist will include 22 videos that will cover all the important type of positions that you need to know when dealing with this type of endgames. In the first video, we're going to go over the most important positions involving Rook and Pawn on the 7th rank versus Rook. In the second video, we're going to talk about the Lucena position. In the third video, we're going to learn the Philidor defense. The fourth and fifth video will go over the importance of having a rook behind the pass pawn. In the sixth video, we're going to look at the long size check defense with the pawn on the seventh rank. The seventh and eighth video will go over some important tactical elements that are very frequent in your endgames. In the ninth video, we're going to look at the rook and pawn on the 6th rank versus rook when the defending king is in front of the pawn. In the tenth video, we're going to look at the positions that involve rook and pawn on the 6th rank versus rook where the defending king is not in front of the pawns. In the eleventh video, we're going to look at the Vancura defense. In the twelfth video, we're going to take a look at positions that involve a rook and pawn on the 5th rank versus rook where the defending king is in front of the pawns. The 13th video will go over these positions where the defending king is not in front of the pawns. In the 14th video, we're going to take a look at the long distance checks defense complete video that includes the pawn being on all the different ranks, the 7th, the 6th, the 5th rank combined. The 15th video is just a quick review of the theory for the long distance checks defense. The 16th video goes over the Klingon Horowitz defense. The 17th video goes over the positions that involve a rook and pawn on the 4th rank versus rook where the defending king is in front of the pawns. The 18th video goes over the rook and pawn on the 4th rank versus rook where the defending king is cut off by one file. The 19th video will go over these positions where the defending king is cut off by two or more files. The 20th video is going to go over the positions where the king is cut off via a rank. The 21st video is a quick theory review involving the defending king being cut off. And then the last video goes over the positions where you're defending against the pawn on the 7th rank from the side. As you watch these lessons, I encourage you to practice them against the computer on my website, MasterTress.com. If you appreciate my content and my website, I encourage you to like my videos, comment and subscribe to my channel to promote my content which will help me keep my website for free. To access the playlist, all you have to do is click on the video in the lower corner of my channel or click on playlist and then click on Rook and Pawn vs. Rook. Thank you for watching.